Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. French toasts are great for breakfast, especially if you're someone who's into bread. I actually enjoy them now and then, and today I'm going to share a wonderful Mexican style French toast recipe. It's actually called Torijas and it is famous in Mexico. So let's get started and check out the recipe. For this toast, first I'm going to make the flavored sugar syrup. To a saucepan, add half cup of brown sugar, half cup of water, mix it in. Next, add a piece of cinnamon stick, a few peppercorns, quarter teaspoon of nutmeg powder and mix everything. I'm also adding quarter cup of white granulated sugar. Once you've added all the ingredients, let it simmer for a few minutes till the syrup thickens a bit. So after a few minutes, you can see the syrup is a little thick and it becomes lightly sticky. So that's the indication that the syrup is ready. Turn off the stove and keep the syrup aside. To another bowl, take two cups of boiled and cooled milk. Add half teaspoon of vanilla essence. This will give a very nice flavor. Mix that in and keep it aside. The next step is to prepare the egg mixture. For this, I've taken four large eggs. I'm going to separate the whites and the yolks. So make sure you have two separate bowls. Crack open the eggs one by one. Separate the whites and keep the yolks separately. So just make sure you do this carefully. This is a very simple and basic way to separate the eggs. This is how I do it. So once you've separated the eggs, add a pinch of salt to the egg whites and start whisking them. I'm using an electric whisk here. Whisk the egg whites till you get soft peaks and it's nice and foamy like this. This is how we want it. Next, add the egg yolks to the egg whites and continue whisking it. If you don't have an electric beater, you can also use the hand whisk. Uh, it's just going to take a lot more time to get that nice fluffy texture. So now we've whisked both the egg whites and the yolks to a nice foamy and fluffy texture. You can see how beautiful that looks. So next we're going to start coating the bread slices to a nice wide plate for the vanilla milk. So we have the vanilla milk, the eggs and also keep the pan of oil ready to fry the slices of bread. Take one slice of bread, dip it in the milk. Make sure the bread slices are nice and thick while making these toasts. So I have bought bakery bread and I've cut it into one inch slices. Coat both sides of the bread with milk. Now carefully place the bread slice into the egg mixture. You can see that beautiful foamy egg that's coating the bread slice. Now gently place it onto the pan. Make sure the oil is on medium heat. So basically we're going to shallow fry the bread slices. Egg mixture is going to give a very nice and fluffy texture on top and it's going to make the slice very crispy on the outside. You can see how beautifully it's fried. It's got that lovely golden brown color. Once you fry the bread slice on both sides, remove from the oil and keep it aside. Make sure to follow the same steps for all the bread slices. Strain the flavored sugar syrup before you pour it onto the bread slices. Wow, look at that rich brown sugar syrup. Now other options instead of sugar syrup is you can use honey, you can use maple syrup if you like. But let me tell you, the flavor of this particular syrup is entirely different. Gently drizzle the syrup on top of these beautiful, crispy, Mexican-style French toast and serve it immediately. Uh, let me tell you that they definitely taste a bit different from the usual French toast that we make because the technique and the method by which we've done this is a little different from the usual method that we do it in. These toreas or the Mexican style French toasts are a perfect treat for your kids. They'll absolutely love it. These toreas are amazingly delicious and I can't get enough of it. I'm sure everybody at home will absolutely enjoy these, especially your kids. So you can make these for breakfast or as an evening snack. Do try the recipe, enjoy and share it with your family and friends. So for more exciting and wonderful recipes, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get your notifications.
The second edition of our home cooking book is now available on our website 21frames.in. I'll give you the link in the description. You can go and check it out. The book is currently available only in India for now. So you can place your orders on 21frames.in.